Hello, I'm Dara and I'm a technical support engineer here at Simply Nook and today I'm going to show you how to upgrade your wireless network card or Wi-Fi card. So before we begin, we'll need a few things. You'll want a screwdriver to unscrew the base plate and unscrew the old wireless network module. You'll want your ESD equipment to prevent electrostatic discharge and of course, you'll want your wireless module. So as we begin, we will flip the unit over, like such, and unscrew the four corners of the nook. I've pre-loosened these, so I can take this off now, just be careful. Sometimes the threads get caught. We'll leave this to the side, and watch out for this cable for the SSD expansion. You don't want that to unclip. And I will show you that the Wi-Fi module is right here. So what we need to do is we need to unscrew we need to unscrew the screw that is holding it down and unclip carefully the two wire uh, antenna wires. So I will do that now. Carefully unscrew. Leave that to the side. It's a very small screw. It'll be easiest to pull out the Wi-Fi card. Just a gentle wiggle will do it. And now it is free floating. And then we'll get our finger just underneath those cables and gently pry them off. Very easy. So now we'll place that to the side and take our new wireless module and it would be easiest to do this before you plug it in. We will clip on the antenna wires very carefully. You kind of have to hang it off one edge and then push down the other side to clip it on. That one clipped on very nicely and we'll glue the other one. Sometimes you will hear a small little click, that way you know it's on. So now we have our Wi-Fi card floating there. We want to plug it in just like we did with the other one. So now I'll turn this around and be careful to not undo the clips that we've just done. And we will slot it into our M.2 key E slot. Just like that. So we'll get our screw that we use to hold it down. I have a magnetic screwdriver so it helps keep the screw on. So now we have the Wi-Fi module screwed down and that's the upgrade complete. So now we can put the base plate back on, screw down the four corners. Thank you very much. 